Do you sometimes wish you were never born? I mean, you didn't even ask to be born, right? Life was thrust upon you and you had no say in the matter. I used to believe that. My 20s was plagued with my bipolar type 1 and I had severe manic episodes that were completely destructive to my life. After medication woke me out of my manic episodes, I would always feel like, what the fuck? It felt like my life got hit by a truck and I was in shambles. Life was happening to me, not for me. Life was utter chaos and I had no control over it. I'm 33 years old, but I have nothing to show for it. Half my friends are married, they bought a place to live, they're responsible adults, and in the meantime, I moved back in with my mom and I don't have a job now, I don't even have my own place. Having said all that, I've now chosen to believe that life happens for me, not to me. I've chosen to believe that I chose this life, I've chosen to be born, I've chosen this reality. I've chosen to believe that my world takes care of me and everything is turning out as it should. In the face of anything good or bad, I've chosen to start saying, thanks for everything, I have no complaint whatsoever. So why did I choose to believe all these things? Is it because I know something about the fabric of reality that you don't? No, it's just that when I've heard or read these beliefs that you can adopt, these sayings that you can repeat, I realized they shape my reality just by repeating and believing those things. If two people face the same tragedy and one says, why does shit always happen to me? And the other says, thanks for everything, I have no complaint whatsoever. They experience different realities even though they encountered the same thing. One is complaining and resisting while the other is accepting and embracing. The lens at which you look at life shapes the reality in which you live. Maybe you're saying, Paul, that's cope. You're just mentally tricking yourself into accepting reality better. And I would say, that's good cope. Anything that gets you to take responsibility for what you experience and accept it better is a good thing whether it's a trick or not. I repeat these phrases to myself whether small or big things happen, good or bad, on a daily basis. When I catch multiple traffic lights in a row and I'm driving smoothly with no stops, I say to myself, my world takes care of me. And when I got shingles three weeks ago and I was in a lot of pain, I mean, I'm still in pain right now, but I keep saying to myself, my world takes care of me. Everything is turning out as it should. Thanks for everything. I have no complaint whatsoever. And has my life changed since I started repeating those sentences? Yes, it has. It's been subtle at first, but now I think it's immensely changed the conversation that I have with myself. It doesn't mean I don't have bad days anymore, but how I react to those bad days has changed. A bad day doesn't stay a bad day. My negative feelings dissipate much more quickly. Over a long time period, I'm less stressed than I used to be, even if I have stressful events happen during that period. If you don't believe in any of the statements I mentioned, forget your world takes care of you and everything is turning out as it should, and just focus on, thanks for everything, I have no complaint whatsoever. That you can repeat to yourself even if you believe in none of the other statements. That's from this book, The Tao Te Ching. Whenever something good happens to you, or whenever something bad happens to you, or whenever you wake up or go to bed at night, say to yourself, Thanks for everything, I have no complaint whatsoever. It has been life-changing for me in a good way. Repeating these things hasn't changed the circumstances of my life, but it certainly changed how I feel about it, how I feel day to day. And isn't that the most important thing? Feeling good about life day to day? It's not about believing in something woo-woo, it's about believing in something that improves your life. And anything that improves your life is by definition, life-changing. So by improving my day-to-day -day life, it truly has been life-changing. So if you feel down about your life or if you feel good about your life, try saying this. Whenever something happens, whether good or bad, and every morning and every night, say, thanks for everything, I have no complaint whatsoever. It's made me appreciate every little good thing even more and allowed me to swallow the bad things more easily. Over time, it just might change your outlook on life like it has for me. 1% better every day, baby. Tigger loves sunbathing. He will just sit here for hours and eat grass. <laughs> mm -hmm.